What's up YouTube? It's Ben back again uh, with some pickups. Uh, this came in yesterday or today it was a trade on um, Trading Card Database. Uh, a few 78 tops I need for my set and a few Cubs cards. I actually, I may have these stashed somewhere, especially these two. If I had put them on my want list, somebody offered me a trade and I'm relatively new there with trading. So I uh, went ahead and accepted the trade. Um, got this 2000 Pacific Prism Fred McGriff printing plate. It's blank on the back. Uh, these aren't on a checklist, so not 100% sure how legit those are, but I got one. Um, let's see. This I got off eBay. Uh, excuse me. Uh, I don't have a ton of just regular base cards of McGriff signed, like hand signed. Um, this is a 91 Donruss MVP, of course, and this just has the auto certified. Um, but this was like 10 bucks or so, so worth it to me. Um, let's go ahead and roll through the McGriff stuff. Um, we got this, I believe it's a uh, tribute from 2016. Um, number 75 of 99. I still got to put it in another top loader. Um, got this tribute number to 189. I believe it's 91. 189. That's an on card auto from 2015. Tribute. Really nice card. Um, this is from Chronicles from 2017 Panini. This is number 39 of 49. It is a sticker auto. Um, this one's a sticker auto as well, but we got a nice patch there. Probably looks devil raised to me. Numbered 17 to 25. Basically the same card as that one, just a different parallel. Let's see, does that knock all the mandatory McGriff out? Okay, some of these were eBay pickups and some of these for the card show I went to uh, last weekend. This was an eBay pickup. I am working on the uh, post-war Hall of Fame registry set on uh, PSA so I got this Vlad Guerrero uh, 95 Bowman's Best in a Mint 9 for my set I this was a eBay purchase I believe this was really cheap 91 Upper Deck Final Edition Pedro Martinez also in a Mint 9 I'm okay with 9's on this I'm doing this set for fun I don't want to spend the extra money it's on the tens on these guys here. Um, 88 score traded Biggio in a mint nine as well. Um, also, 88 score traded Roberto Alomar also in a mint nine. And a lot of these are recent grades. Um, I think I got this at the card show for pretty cheap, older slab, but that's okay. Uh, 90 Frank Thomas mint nine, nice card. Got this one really, really cheap. I just picked it up for the heck of it. This is not in the registry set. Uh, the 90 Leaf Sammy Sosa. He's not in the Hall of Fame. I'll be surprised if he ever is. But who knows. Um, this was a card show pickup as well. This was really cheap. This 92 Bowman. Pedro Martinez. This was just a uh, pickup just to put back and stash away. Um, I also consider this... He's got the 91 Upper Deck uh, Final Edition. That's kind of like a traded. And then this is a, a regular issue from 92, which you can almost, I guess, consider a rookie. And also got this 93 Upper Deck Derek Jeter to PSA 9, which is also a recent uh, slab. Um, got that as a card show also. Um, I picked up some packs. They're out of uh, reach right now. Some 81 uh, tops. That I'll be doing on the pack a day videos. Um, got a few 91 Don Russ boxes, just uh, they were like five bucks a box. Those are just to rip to see if I get an elite. They may not make the videos because they're not really worth fooling with on that. And uh, I think I got a 92. Whatever the Jeter, 92, 93, whatever Jeter's rookie is and is in tops. I got a wax box of that as well. 
so that may make the videos we may uh, rip some of those packs so anyway guys that's my recent pickups been really back into picking up my griffs again according to my list on trading card database I have um, 1360 something no excuse me 1630 plus now because I just added a few in uh, Fred McGriff cards so yeah we got a bunch and uh, that's not counting doubles and some things that aren't listed on there but uh, anyways guys thanks for watching take care and we'll see you again soon